Tell me about this comic book. Okay, so the famous weather girl named Fran Wallace got her money stolen. How much? A lot. That's not very nice. I know. So Fran finds this detective named Carly McDonald, who is the worst detective in the whole state of Delaware, and she goes. How have I been robbed? Wait. My money was stolen. By who? I don't know. How much money? A lot. That's not very nice. I know, please help me. Don't. Could you please give me your name? I'm Fran Wallace. Fran Wallace. Fran from San Fran. Okay. Never mind, you probably don't recognize me because of my haircut. Wait, you said Fran's a famous weather girl. Carly never saw her on TV. Nope, and that makes Fran very mad. How mad? Very. Ooh, what happens next? There's these two superheroes named Flex the Fantastic and Bella the Brilliant. They're arresting a crook, but then they get distracted by someone littering. Excuse me, miss, you dropped something. Yeah, you dropped something. Pick it up now. My girl here. Pretty please. It's good for the environment. No, the gods aren't real superheroes. You're just playing dress up. Are you sure you want to take that chance? Whatever, you guys need to get a life. We better not do that again, or you will pay. By what? Living in a polluted world? Yes, but there's actually a fine you'll have to pay. Whatever, I've got plenty of money. There's something off about her. Flex, what are you doing? That's disgusting. Evidence. So now there's this evil person named Pobla Bubberkirk. She's the bad guy. What's her deal? She loves milk. I love milk. Hello, Pobla. It turns out Eva's the one who stole Fran's money. No way, what did she use it for? To buy panda meat for Pobla. I have your order. Excellent. Now I want my money. What money? The money I've earned for doing your work. Hand it over. We'll split the money from the sales we make. Now join me for my evil laughter. <laughs> Wait, why would Bubble buy panda meat? What kind of evil plan is this? She wants to make Sweppy Dogs and sell them for a lot of money. Huh? Sweppy Dogs. They're like hot dogs, except they're made of pandas and they taste better. You're gross. Who would eat that? It was in my purse. Aha, uh -huh. and exactly how much money was missing? I already told you, $2,000. When did you notice the money was gone? Um, when I looked inside my purse and saw it was gone. Interesting. Very interesting. Now, Fran, I want you to think, did you buy anything recently? I bought a spubby dog. A spubby what now? A spubby dog. It's like a hot dog, except more spubby, and they taste better. Gross. Who would eat that? Fran, Sam Fran, that's who. You've seriously never heard of me? Just take me to where you got this gross hot dog. Fine. I smell pandas. Pandas? Yes, panda meat with mustard. This is the ridiculous thing I've ever heard you say. Smell. Golly, someone's killing the pandas. I knew it. Who would do such a mean thing? There can only be one, and I know who. Who? A villain driven mad by her consumption of milk. No, 
Not her. Yes, her. Hobla Bubba Cook. We must bring her to justice. Right. Oh, Betsy. Let's ride. Candy's ready. Are the scrubby dogs ready yet? Just wrap the last one. We're all set. Excellent. Why do we have to wear these? Wear what? The hot dog costume. It's part of the experience. What experience? The scrubby dog experience. Just deal with it. Fine. We've got customers. Fantastic. Where's my milk? Isn't that the weather girl we stole from? Be cool. Here, put these on. That's not much of a disguise. You're wearing a hot dog costume. He'll never recognize you. Oh, right. Good thinking. Now be cool. Hi, officer. Is there a problem? I have some questions to ask you. Sure, but first, would you like a spubby dog? Why did you steal Fran's money? Excuse me? How dare you call me a thief? I'm sorry. I did it. I needed the money for the fans of me. <laughs> hey, boss. So it was you! <laughs> Hand to me! Hey look, some cop is trying to beat us to the job. Let's put a stop to it. Yeah, this is our case. Come, Betsy. Whoa, Betsy, whoa. Who do you think you are, detective? This is our case. I was here first. Don't you know who I am? No, why should I? I give up. Look, we can take it from here. I don't think so. I was here first. Come on, pretty please. No, don't play your dress up game somewhere else. Look, I try to be nice, but you leave me no choice. Oh, Betsy. Wait a minute, what about Pobla? We've got her. <laughs> what about them? Don't worry, they'll be fine. Let's gather all this evidence. So, what do you think? Pretty good, but it sounds like we're getting copycats. What do you mean? I mean, this comic book sounds familiar. Nope, this is completely original. Oh, really? Ever seen these movies before?
<coughs> awkward. Okay. Hand to me! No, you spit to the side. I want you to spit on Bella. I want you to hit Bella with your spit. Are you there's no smiling allowed in a gym camp. Come on. No smiling. Help me! I've been robbed! I've been robbed! Help me! Oh, oh. We got through. You got something! Spit in my hand and then say Rob. Me. <laughs> whoa, okay, go back. You have to tell her to whoa before she stops. Sorry. Wait, I'm not even out of the shot. Give me a break. Hold on. Oh, Betsy. All right, I can. Whoa. I can. I can. They, then they saw a dirty crook littering. <laughs> don't spit, I can't have you spitting out. You don't like bread. That's so crazy. She doesn't like bread, she doesn't like milk. This show is completely miscast. Okay, here we go, ready? Back to Bella. You know what? I try to be nice, but you leave me no choice. <laughs> no, stop, no, I'm not part of this. <laughs> No, you gotta run in there. No. You, can't, you missed the door. No. No. It's right there. <laughs>